Hey guys, it's Mary and first of all, I just want to say we're over halfway through this Christmas Around the World series. Um, so yeah, I'm very excited for that. This is the 40, 41st country out of 80 of them. So we literally Japan was the 40th. Um, but we're going to talk about Christmas in Kazakhstan. Which I actually had to Google what Kash where Kazakhstan was, but Kazakhstan is, is a Central Asian country and former Soviet Republic extent and extends from the Caspian Sea in the west to the Altia Mountains at its eastern border with China and Russia. So, for most of it, it's like Russia, Mongolia. And in the middle is Kazakhstan. So I think it's going to be interesting to see, like, if they have different parts of, like, Chinese culture and Russian culture in it, as well as, like, some of the, um, like, Indian culture. As well, because it looks like India was close by, too. So, Christmas in Kazakhstan is almost always snowy, as it snows for around four months of the year during the winter. About 70% of people in Kazakhstan are Muslim, so Christmas isn't a big holiday, and December 25th is a day just like any other day. This means the shops are open, the public transport is running, and everyone is at work. Christians in Kazakhstan don't normally celebrate Christmas on Christmas Day, unless they happen to be off work, or it's a Sunday. Instead, the main Christmas celebrations are on the Sunday before Christmas Day. Christians in Kazakhstan have translated some English songs to Kazka and Russian, and there are a few traditional songs that were composed in Kazakhstan, but they normally sing their usual worship songs in church on the day they celebrate Christmas. Christmas is also a good time for Christians to bring their friends along to a church service who haven't heard about Jesus in Christmas before. Some people wonder that Christmas is wonder what Christmas is all about and also like the idea of an extra party. <laughs> Hospitality is very important to all Kazakhstanians. So after the Christmas service, people from the church and any friends they've invited have, invited have a meal together. Tables are covered with fruit and nuts, chocolates and burshka, like donuts, salads and pulled rice, beef and carrots cooked in oil and cumin. Although Christmas isn't widely celebrated, the following week is the biggest celebration of the year for Kaz Kazakhstanians. New Year. So why they aren't Christmas trees, Father Christmas, or Santa, or Christmas presents for the good children, there is a New Year tree. There is a snow father and a snow maiden, his younger female helper. And children do get New Year's presents. When Kazakhstan was part of the USSR, which is the Soviet Union, all re religions were banned and the government made the New Year celebration important. That is why there is still more important Christmas today, even after 20 years from the collapse of the USSR. Um, by the way, the reason why that is with the religion is because the USSR, the Soviet Union, um, was communist. Probably really shouldn't be talking about this on here, but communism is essentially total communism. Essentially, when the government controls every aspect of life. So, I, like my history teacher told us last year, we haven't got to the point of total communism. There is still a lot of communism in the world. In fact, oh, sorry, continuing on. In fact, Kazakhstan finalized independence from the USSR on December 25th, 1991. So that was, what, 16, 26 years ago, I think? Kazakhstan Independence Day is celebrated on December 16th. The day is officially independence declared from the Soviet Union. Just as countries have celebrations and they went up to Christmas, Kazakhstan's New Year celebration started in early December. Celebrating Christmas on the Sunday before the December 25th was right in for the Kazakhstani Christians. A New Year's celebration, children recite a poem or, a song, or sing a song about 
the Jolly Father Snow in his red suit and gives them a New Year's present around the New Year's tree. There are bubbles, which are ornaments, and twinkly lights in the shops, uh, windows, and everyone is excited. So other than change of date, despite being a Muslim country, Christmas ends up being pretty similar to Christmas elsewhere in the world. But not many people know their story and the birth of Jesus. So essentially, I learned from this, Christmas is pretty much similar to everywhere else in the world in Kazakhstan. Kazakhstan was a communist-run country, or Soviet Union-run country, technically. And that is very close to Russia, so it was a satellite station, most likely, it seems like. But, anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed. Love you, see ya, bye.